Thanks for downloading the sheet. So what I'm going to do now is just do a quick overview of how to run the sheet. What it basically does is use your blog posts and turns it into social media posts uh, with using AI chat GDP. So all we have to do is download all our posts. So I just use WP all export and it's just a WordPress plugin. It's a free plugin and you can do, ah, so before we actually do this, what you want to do is actually make a copy of the sheet so you can actually edit it and uh, have it as your own. So just make a copy. And then when we're on WP uh, all export, we want to select posts. If your site's built with pages, you can do pages as well. But mine's built with posts, so we'll just download these. So there's 373. Customize export here. And what you want to do is make sure it matches what it is on the sheet. So how I've set it up is title first. And then it's the URL or permalink. Do that there. And then we got content last here. So you just press continue. And then you press confirm and run or save and run. And then you just download as a CSV. I've already done this, so I'm not going to do it again. And then when we're back onto our sheet, if we go to WP all export, and then we go file, uh, file import, upload, browse, and then we pick the export we've just downloaded. And then this is very important. You want to make sure it's replaced the current sheet. Click import data here. And then what this would do is upload your title URLs and your content. There we go. But as you notice, there's like the WP paragraph and there's WP headings and loads of other unwanted code, which is going to, it's going to make our prompt too long and we're not going to get the actual content we want. So what I've done here after the import, if you go to this code tab, we want to copy these two columns here. So we want to copy D1 and D2, go to back to this, paste it in here. And then I've put some code in here to shorten uh, all these sections here and just give you the actual uh the actual content itself so there's a script on this so if you can see there's a custom menu at the top you have to run the script and then you got to give it the permission so you got to press continue do the whole login situation and then allow so as soon as it's allowed and you have the scripts then the script's running and then what it will do is automatically shorten all this text and it will run the ai section as well so uh, what I've done here is I've got the prompt in this top here and you can edit this how you want, but I found it uh, works rather well with creating social media content, but you can edit this how you want. It's always going to be the prompt. And then what it will do is use this content tab here, which is pulled in from the WP all export. And all you got to do is click one of these check boxes and then it will run the script here. So I've done that. So you don't use all your credits. Uh, if you know how to do the sheet, you can play around with it and get rid of this, but I've found it a lot, uh, a lot better. So you don't use the credits and like posts you don't want to get the content for. So you just tick that and then the script will start running for you. The reason I got the error and it would uh, generate the post is because you need to download an extension. So you just want to download the ChatGP extension for your Google sheet. So you just type in AI here. And then just download this one here and then just import your API code and then it will work fine. And it takes a little while, especially if you've got like a bigger site and cause there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of app script going on, especially to like shorten the content and, uh, remove all the extra stuff, which, uh, comes with the export. Cool. So now it's done what I've done here. So I've, I'm just copying that now. And then I put a paste tab here. So if you just press, uh, if you're on a Mac, it's Command, Shift, and V. If you're on a Windows, it's Control, Shift, V. Uh, so that's just so we can see it. So it's done nice, like it's quite a nice social media post here. Uh, and that's it. That's all you have to do to get your content all social media ready. And it's actually coming from your post. So it's, it's pretty much good for like every platform. You just have to edit it how you want. Cool. So once we've done the social media, I've added a little bonus in, which is the search functionality here. And then what this does is for basically internal linking. So now we've got all the content here. What you do is just change this to a single word. Uh, and then what it will do is just scan all the posts for that single word. So say if you got like VPN, if you put VPN here, 
uh, and you want to check if it's mentioned in any of the posts, but not linked uh, to a key post. I can I kind of do it with like uh, apps and programs. So, like for me, for a few of my sites, like the main income is from like apps and programs. So I want to search all my content to see if I mention like an app or a program. And this is just a really quick way of doing it. So you can just change this to any word where you want it. Depends what your site's about and what the niche is. So I'm back. So uh, I've been trying to suss this out and put in the app script to basically sort the bugs out before giving to you guys. Uh, so what I've just done is just included one uh, internal link. So all you have to do is just change the the top word here and then it will scan all your content and just check if it's true or false. If you do what, more than one search, like one more, like another query, another column of this, it kind of gets buggy. So I've just deleted it and just stuck to one. So you can just change it and then it just change to true or false. So this way it just helps you internal link with the keywords. So you can just change your keyword here and just check if it's in the content. And that way you can just improve your money pages a lot easier uh, and quicker using it this way. All right, guys, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, just reach out to me. Uh, I think I've covered everything, but if I haven't, I apologize. All right, cheers, bye.